Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and happy Thursday. So we are in front of Publix. We're going to run inside, do a couple of deals. It's not a couple of deals. We're going to do quite a few deals. I'm super excited about Publix this week. Um, and on Saturday, I'm going to come back and we are going to do um, another Publix haul because we are getting a new extra savings flyer and there are some extra savings um, coupons that I want to use. So we're going to do a haul today and we're going to do one on Saturday and I will record that one. Um, my kids are probably going to be with me unless I can wait till my husband wakes up in the afternoon and then have him watch them. Um, but we definitely will be doing a haul on Saturday. I'm super, super excited about it as well. So we are also trying to finish our um, $10 bonus. I don't remember what it's called, but we did get a bonus on Ibotta for redeem 36 offers, get $10 back. So hopefully we do finish it Um while we are here so we are going to end up going to two different stores for inventory reasons because i already checked out the store last night um and earlier this morning to see what the inventory was the specific items that i needed so we're going to end up going to two separate stores and i did go to when dixie this morning when i dropped my kids off and i did get the three off of 30 so I got it on a couple of phone numbers. So I have three of these that we're gonna be using. So we're gonna split up our transactions so that we can use these. Um, so there will be three transactions that we do today. Um, but I'm super excited. I really am super excited about these deals. So hopefully they have everything we need. There's another couponer that she, I actually met her um, a couple weeks back and then there's another couponer that she also does. I bought it as well. So I know that she's probably going to be here. So hopefully she didn't wipe the store out of everything that we need to pick up today. Um, there's a couple different publics around me. So her and I usually kind of just like, like I go this one, she goes to that one. So we'll see when we get in there um if you are new make sure that you hit that subscribe button if you are not already subscribed and then make sure you hit the notification bell down below and have it set to all and not personalized so that you don't miss out when i post new videos and then always in the description box down below so where the title of the video is there in the right corner there's like a little arrow if you press that it'll drop down and it will open up the description box and I'll have any referral codes or anything like that that you need that are going to be down there so the links to those referral codes will be down there in the description box and then if I use any printable coupons today um, that aren't from coupons.com which you guys know the website for coupons.com which is coupons.com um, but if I use any other additional printable coupons like from a specific website I will drop the link down below um, and I'll pin it in the comments on where I got the printable coupon from which is going to be a couple of those coupons that I will be putting in the um, pinned comment to show you guys where to get it. Um, we are definitely doing quite a few rebates on Ibotta. So if you're not signed up with Ibotta, go ahead and make sure that you are signed up with Ibotta. Um, what else? I think that's it. So let's go ahead and run inside. All right, you guys, so the first thing that I always tell you guys to do is to stop by the Publix Information Center. It looks like this right at the front of my store and look for the coupon books that they have. So they have the extra savings flyer that is always up here. And then we have this new coupon book, the Be The Best You. And we are going to be using some coupons out of this. So I'm definitely going to grab a few of these, which I feel like is such a waste of paper, but yeah. So we're gonna be grabbing a few of these. And if you can find this new baby book, there are some coupons that we're going to be using in this as well. Now, it doesn't look like it would be a coupon book, but when you open it and go to this page right here, these are coupons. And you know they're coupons because they have the lookup number down here at the very bottom. So make sure that you grab it and if you can't find it in your store, I will insert a um, tutorial that I screenshotted from my phone to show you guys how you can print it out from the Publix website. Alright you guys, so here I am on the internet on my phone. I went to Publix.com and I logged in onto my Publix account. So what you're going to do is you're going to look in the top left hand corner for these three lines and go ahead and click that. 
After you click that, it'll drop down this menu. So you're going to go where it said savings and you're going to click weekly ad. Once it pops up this screen, you're going to go ahead and select the ad that you want. So we're going to click on where it says baby item sale. Once you get to this screen, this will be the ad. So you can use the arrows to scroll over to whichever part of the ad that you want to see. So we're going to go over and scroll to the coupon that we want to print. So here we're going to say that we want to print this $3 off to Johnson's baby products. So we're going to go ahead and select it. Once you have it selected, the screen will look like this and you will be able to print the coupon. If your phone is connected to your printer, you should be able to print it from your phone. If not, do the same steps on a desktop or laptop computer. All right, you guys, so the first transaction that we're gonna do, we're gonna pick up two of the Plum Organics, the Jammy Sammies, for $3.29. That's gonna total us $6.58. From that baby booklet that I showed you up front, we're gonna go ahead and use this $3 off to Publix coupon. So then we're gonna be left to pay $3.58. Then we're gonna submit to Ibotta for $2, a dollar back on each one. So it's going to make it a final out-of-pocket cost of $1.58 for two. All right, you guys. So the next deal that we're going to pick up is going to be on the Colgate Optic White Toothpaste. So they are two for six this week. And in the Be The Best You uh, Publix booklet, there is this three off of two Publix coupon. So we're going to go ahead and use that. That's going to make it two for $3. And then in my email, I got these $1.50 off any one Colgate Total or Optic White. So I'm going to go ahead and pick up four of these toothpaste and all four are going to be completely free. If you don't have the $1.50 off coupon, then a lot of these products have 50 cent off one um, Peelys on them. Or you can go to the Colgate website and see if you can print off a 75 cent or a $1 off. So the You'll Play Goger, they are buy one get one free, price at $2.69. From coupons.com, I printed off this $1.50 off any two. So that's going to leave us to pay just $1.19 for two, and I'm going to go ahead and pick up four of these. So I saw this hang tag hanging off of uh, one of the yogurts. So it's for the Chobani Completes and it is a $1.50 off two and they are two for $3. So this coupon's gonna make it uh, two for $1.50. And then I'm gonna submit to Ibotta for 50 cents back when you purchase two. So it's gonna make it just a dollar for two or 50 cents each. So definitely look out to see if you see any of these hang tags on the product. Next, we're gonna pick up one of these perfect bars. So they're four for 10, which means they're $2.50 each. And then we're gonna submit back to Ibotta for $2.25. It says it's for a free um, product, but the prices do vary per store. So this is end up just gonna end up being 25 cents. So the last thing that we're gonna pick up in this transaction is going to be on the Mao Mix cat food. So they're buy one get one free price at $5.29 in my store. From their website, I was able to print out $2 off one printable coupons. So I'm going to go ahead and use two of these, pick up two of the bags. So it's going to make just $1.29 for two. We don't have any cats because my husband doesn't like cats and won't let me get one, but our neighbor has a cat. So I'm going to go ahead and give these to them. All right, you guys, so now we are at our next store and we are gonna get and work on transaction number two. So transaction number two, we are simply gonna work on the spend 30, get a $10 Publix gift card. So you uh, participate, buy $30 in participating products and get $10 back in a Publix gift card. And there you can see all the participating products and here's the website down here for you to go to, activaterewards.com. So I'll give you guys a second to screenshot that. And I will always drop the link down below for something like this. So what we're going to do first is we're going to pick up four of these Band-Aid brand products um, priced at $1.99. And then we're going to use two of these three off of two. Um, any Band-Aid brand bandages, one to 100 count. I'm pretty sure we can use this on the gauze. Normally when they have this kind of coupon, you can use it on the gauze. And then I'll just double check when we get up to the front. But we're going to go ahead and use two of these because they're $3 off two. And then we're going to pick up um, another item. So the next part of our spend 30 to get a $10 public gift card is going to be on some Johnson's and Johnson's 
products. So the Johnson baby products are buy two get three dollars off. So that three dollars will come off automatically at the register as long as you buy in pairs of two. So picking up two of the wipes price at three dollars and nineteen cents and then the three dollars coming off automatically that's going to leave you to pay three dollars and 38 cents but in that baby booklet that i showed you guys up front we're going to use this three off of two Publix coupon and it does include the wipes so then we're just going to be left to pay 38 cents for two however for this deal we're going to end up picking up 12 of these and then we're going to use six of these coupons all right you guys so here is transaction number two so we have all of our wipes over here and we have our gauze so these products grand total is $32.22. I'm going to use my other 3 off of 30 purchase space that I got from Winn-Dixie. And then after all of our Publix coupons, and that's all we're using is nothing but Publix coupons, we should be left to pay $2.22 at the register. And then we're going to submit to get that $10 uh, Publix gift card back. And when we do, that's going to make all of these free in a $7.78 money maker. Now, normally when we have these rebates, um, they will count uh, before coupons and uh, before tax. So just keep that in mind when you're doing your deal. And if you don't have enough stock in certain items, you can always mix and match because the um, promotion does include a lot of products. Now, I have two babies. Um, one is a two-year-old and one is a three-year-old. They are both messy. So all of these wives will go to use. And if they, you know, we have too many, then I will give some to my neighbors because my neighbors have kids as well. And I did not wipe out the store for anyone that's like, oh my God, you wiped out the store. I did not. There's more than enough left back there. All right, you guys. So now we're starting transaction number three. This is our final transaction. So the Tazo T is buy one, get one free this week. Price at $3.99. Um, and then you do have some that are priced a little bit higher at $4.59. In front of the product, there is the blinky for a dollar off one. Unfortunately, mine is empty, but if yours is full, go ahead and get two of those. Use two of those coupons. You're just going to pay $1.99 for two if you get the $3.99 ones. Or if you get the $4.59 ones, then you will pay $2.59 for two. The Quaker Chewy Bars are buy one one free price at three dollars and nineteen cents from coupons.com. I printed out this dollar off two printable coupon, so we're gonna go ahead and pick up two. Use a dollar off two, so we're gonna pay two dollars and nineteen cents for two. So the Truvia is regular price three dollars and seventy nine cents in the Be the Best You or Best of You uh, coupon book up front. There's this $1.50 off any one Truvia product, so we're gonna go ahead and use this. And then I have a $1.50 digital that I'm going to use as well. So we're gonna pay 79 cents in store, but then we're gonna submit back to my bottom and we're gonna get back a dollar fifty. So it's gonna make this free any 101 money maker. Now you can get more than one if you have the insert. The inserts also had the dollar fifty off um, insert coupon. I didn't get any inserts, but if you do, then you can go ahead and do this deal as well. Next, these Scotties, the Triple Soft. So they are just regular two for $3. So they're $1.50 each. And the Triple Soft specifically, not the Everyday Comfort, but the Triple Soft counts for two separate rebates. One for 50 cents back on each box and then one for 50 cents back when you pick up four. So we're gonna go ahead and pick up four of the Triple Soft. That's gonna total us $6. From their website, I was able to print out four of these 65 cent off one printable coupons and i will drop the link down below on where to get these from and i was able to print out um two per browser so that's why i'm able to print out four so we're gonna pay three dollars and forty cents in store but then we're gonna submit to ibotta back for two dollars and fifty cents making it just 90 cents for all four so the Nivea Men Shave Foam, not the gel, the foam, is priced at $2.19. From their website, I was able to print out this dollar off one printable coupon. So we're going to pay $1.19 in store. Cement to I bought it for $0.55. Cents. So it's going to make this shave foam just $0.64. Cents. So the Orida Potato French Fries. So there, buy one, get one free at $3.40. We have a 50 cent rebate on Ibotta, so we're gonna go ahead and pay 340. Submit to Ibotta for a dollar back total, making it just 240 for both. So I'm not picking up the Alpha Burritos, but I wanted to show you guys, now they have this new blinky in front of the product for a dollar off any one. And these are definitely a really 
good um, like addition to my husband's um, lunch and these will regularly go on sale so I would highly suggest picking up a few of these blinkies if you see the product. So we are get, gonna get a nice little freebie. So the Alpha Nuggets, the plant-based chicken nuggets, they're priced at $2.99. And we have a $2.99 rebate on Ambata, so it's gonna make this bag completely free. So I just found my kids dinner for tonight. So for this transaction, I'm working with my husband's Ibotta. So we're gonna go ahead and pick up the Perfect Bar freebie again. So remember, it is $2.50 but I bought it has a rebate for $2.25, so it's gonna make this just $0.25. Cents. All right, guys, so the next thing we're gonna pick up is gonna be some of these Siggy's yogurt. So they're four for $5. We have a digital coupon for a dollar off four, so it's gonna make it four for four. Then we're gonna submit our receipt back to Ibotta and get 50 cents back on all four. So then it's, we're gonna have a final out-of-pocket cost for four for $2. So the Philadelphia cream cheese, they are five for $10, which means they are $2 each. So we're gonna go ahead and pick up one for $2 and then submit to Ibotta for 25 cents. So it's gonna make it just $1.75. So I'm not picking this up, but I did wanna show you guys. So the Chloe Soft Serve Fruit Pops, they're buy one, get one free at $4.99. In my email, I got a PDF coupon for a dollar off any ones. So you'd use two of these and it prints out this big. I, I hate the fact that it prints out this big, but then you'd use two of these coupons. You'd pay $2.99 for two. I'm not gonna pick it up. Um, if we got like a rebate, then I would pick this up. But if you guys need the PDF coupon, I don't know how to post it in the comments with a link so you guys can get to it. So just send me an email and in the subject line, put Chloe's PDF coupon in all caps in the subject line. So that way I can see it in my email and I will go ahead and attach it in the email and send it to you guys. So they break stone, these small sour cream. They're two for $3. So I'm, I'm gonna pick up two for $3. Sim it to I bought it back for 75 cents on each one. So it's gonna make it two for a dollar fifty. So the last item that we're picking up is gonna be on this hummus. So I don't know how to pronounce a brand, but it's hummus. So they're buy one, get one free at $4.99. We have a dollar digital coupon, so we'll pay $3.99 in store. Get back 75 cents for each one on I bought it. So it's gonna make it just two dollars and forty-nine cents for two. Make sure that you guys are checking out your Peelys. So we have some $2 off one boost. We have some 50 cent for the Colgate. We also have some 50 cent for soft soap. So make sure you guys look, look out for some Peelys. All right, you guys, so we are back from Publix and this is everything that we picked up. So we have a full table today. I'm super excited. Um, so everything turned out perfectly well. It didn't have any issues. And we will definitely be doing a second transaction on Saturday because there are some additional deals that I want to get. And um, I also just want to pick up some more repeats that I picked up today if the Ibotta offer resets. Sometimes they'll reset within 48 hours, so that would be perfect. Um, so let's go ahead and go over all three of our receipts. So on this transaction, we had all of our Johnson & Johnson products and our Band-Aid products. So there's a promotion for buy two, get $3 off for the Johnson & Johnson, came off with no problem. All of my coupons were perfectly fine, all Publix coupons, except for this competitor that was three off of 30 from Winn-Dixie. So I did pay a total of $2.22. In this transaction, we had our fries, we had our sour cream, there's our Quaker uh, bars, there's all of our Scotties, there's our Truvia, our Alpha Nuggets for $2.99, there's our cream cheese for $2, there are all of our Siggies, there's our hummus, and then our Perfect Bar for $2.50. All of my coupons came off perfectly fine, so there's my digitals, and then there are all of my printable coupons. And then there is that um, competitor coupon for the off of 30. And then I paid a subtotal of $26.45 for this transaction. Here's our last transaction. So I picked up the Gogurt in this one. I picked up four of them. So the Chubani was actually 10 for 10 and I didn't realize that. I thought they were just two for three, um, but they are 10 for 10. So they bring up a dollar each. There's a Perfect Bar for $2.50. There is the Meow Mix, the Jammy Sammies, the Colgate Toothpaste. And then I use that three off of 30 competitor coupon, the $1.50 off for the, um, oh my gosh, for the yogurt. 
There's a $3 Publix coupon for the Plum Organics, the uh, $3 Publix coupon for the Colgate, and then all the rest of my coupons for the Colgate and um, the cat food. So I paid a subtotal of $7.25 for this transaction. All right, you guys, so after coupons, we paid $35.92 for all three transactions. From Ibotta, we got back $31.51 or $0.54, cents, and that includes the $10 bonus. We did complete it today, and I also got a $0.75 cent game day bonus for buying participating products. Um, the Alrida, I believe, was included the Breakstone Sour Cream, um, oh, excuse me, and then um, the Philadelphia Cream Cheese. I think the Alrida was included. I don't remember, but I know the Philadelphia Cream Cheese was and the Breakstone, so I got 75 cents for that as well. And then if we include the $10 gift card that we will be getting back for the Johnson products and the Band-Aids, that's going to make everything here free in a $5.62 money maker. So I absolutely loved this transaction. I think it was pretty awesome. So let me know if you guys have any questions down below. Um, really quick, I'm going to put this stuff inside and put the stuff in the fridge. And then I want to show you the stuff that I picked up from CVS. All right, so I did stop at CVS and pick up all of those clearance items that you guys saw there um, in my CVS haul. I did end up going back, putting together something so that I can pick those items up because I thought that was a really great clearance price, especially since I had coupons. So I will go ahead and show you my receipt. So here's my receipt. So the Flonase was on clearance for $6.75. Um, original price is $26.99, so it's super expensive in CVS and like any other store. Um, when you go to their website, you are able to get a $5 printable coupon, so I went ahead and printed out two of those. So I picked up two of the Flonies, then I picked up three of these Suave, so they were $1.09 on clearance, and then I picked up three, six, seven, eight. So I picked up seven of the Tresemme dry shampoo. These were all on clearance for $1.82. And then I had a whole bunch of printable coupons for my email from Unilever for um, $1.25 off for the Tresemme dry shampoo. And I also had two 75 cent off ones. And then I had a dollar off printable for the Suave. And then I had the two $5 off for the um, Flonies. There's my dollar digital for the Suave. I also had a 4 of 18 hair care CRT. And unbeknownst to me, I had a throw off a 2 Tresemme uh, CRT. So that took off $2.30 because with all the coupons, there wasn't anything left for it to take off. So it took, only took off two thirty dollars out of the $3. And then I went ahead and used a $4 extra buck to pay for this. So I paid a subtotal of $0.03. Cents. So hopefully all of this clearance hair care does still track towards CVS Beauty. That would be great because I only needed about $15 left to reach Beauty. So that would mean that um, I would get a $3 Beauty buck back in 48 hours. So we'll see in 48 hours if I do get back um, a $3 Beauty buck. So when I do my Saturday haul, I'll let you guys know if I do get back the $3 in beauty bucks. So I definitely wanted to show you guys that transaction. So definitely look out in your CVS to see if you have that same kind of clearance section popping up in your store. So again, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys give it a big thumbs up if you liked the video. If you didn't, let me know down below. Let me know why you didn't like it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button if you're not already subscribed. And if you didn't already, make sure you check back to my previous video where we did a brand new giveaway. So you're going to comment down below in that video. Make sure you guys watch the video to figure out how to enter. And then we will announce the winner on Monday when I do my Monday video. So... I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye guys.